The United States is set to directly fund the right-wing Venezuelan opposition by taking money designated for humanitarian aid in Central America. The Donald Trump administration has said that $41.9 million designated for migrant aid in Guatemala and Honduras would instead be diverted to pay for the needs of the Venezuelan opposition. The money could be used to further criminal enterprise, as evidence has illustrated opposition murder plots, planned coup d'etats, and corruption. Two of opposition figure Juan Guaido's personal security detail have been arrested in connection with the theft of weapons during the failed April 30th coup. Reactionary forces in Venezuela are deeply divided with U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo admitting that as many as 40 individuals are vying for leadership.